Hi, this is Becker from endac.com. Today I'm going to talk to you about the Summarizer plugin. It's a neat little extension to Endac Lab that calculates broad metrics from each of a collection of files to help you gain high-level insights from your recordings. Welcome. So today I'm going to show you guys how to use the Summarizer plugin in Endac Lab. So let's go ahead and open the lab. And if you already have the Summarizer installed, you can go ahead and go to the Tools menu and move down to Batch IDE Summarizer. Go ahead and click on that. And we'll see this pop up here. Now we have to choose a couple of things first. We have to choose the files that we want to process. So we'll go here and click Add. And I'll go ahead and take these four and click Open. So those are listed here. Um, the other thing we have to choose is an output file. So I'll go ahead and click Browse. And here I can choose any file name I want. So I will go ahead and type in Summary. So it will make a summary.csv file with all of the key metrics for these files. Um, it'll generate that file and put it in the same folder as my other IDE files. There are also a handful of other uh, settings that we can toggle on or off. I'll choose to leave them as is. And we go ahead and click Run. And we wait for this progress bar to finish loading. All right, and this is finished. We have this nice confirmation window. Go ahead and click OK. And we can see that in our IDE file folder, there is a summary.csv file. Let's go ahead and open that and take a look. So you can see here that we have a lot of information in a nice table format. So you can see on this column here, we have the file name uh, for each bit of data, um, some other key pieces of information, device serial number, device part number, the channel names, which is important, the type of units for those individual channels, the units, uh, here we have uh, Gs for acceleration, um, the start time and end time of the, the recording, the total duration of the recording, uh, some UTC times, the sampling frequency, and then we have here our key summary metrics. We have a minimum value, maximum value, mean value, and RMS. And that is calculated for each one of these channels in each one of these recordings. And this CSV file can be ingested by for example, Excel, as we're looking at it right now, or if you want to do some automated work with this data, you can process it using a third-party library such as Pandas in Python. As you've seen, the Summarizer plugin is a relatively simple script that provides a lot of value to a broad range of applications. If you'd like a custom script for your specific application, get in touch with us at endac.com. See you next time.